Hello everyone, this is Yukai Chow, and it's pretty ridiculous because I just realized my weight now exceeds 190 pounds, which sucks because I think six months ago I was around 184, 182, and my ideal weight is supposed to be 170, according to my father at least. Um, so I'm like, Yukai, you really gotta lose weight there. So I am declaring to the world, to all my blog readers, all my friends, everyone, that I will not shave until I lose 12 pounds. So going from 192 pounds to 180. And that really gives me the discipline. It's, it's pretty much forcing me to lose weight because I'm putting myself out there in the world. I'm putting my reputation on the line. And if after a while, you know, I have a beard, the whole world gets to see that I'm a failure right on my face, you know, and they can laugh at me. So it'd be pretty pretty sucky if uh, two years later I'm just this really fat dude with a, with a huge beard. You know, that would be pretty bad. So uh, and you know, like losing weight, it's it's not any it's not a secret. It's just eating healthy, exercising, you know, eating healthy times and eating healthy food, right? Pretty simple. You just you have to have the discipline and motivation to do it. And I've actually done something like this before in the past and it worked really well because whenever I'm eating, I'm thinking, well the utility of eating this food compared to the disutility of having this huge beard, it's getting kind of it's getting kind of gross, you know, it's embarrassing, you know, it's just not worth eating the food. And so if you don't when you people don't have that motivation, a lot of people you know, they're like, oh, well, I'm going to lose this tomorrow, lose the weight tomorrow then, or I just went to the gym, you know, that they, you know, they procrastinate. But in my situation, you're not going to do that because you want to lose your beard as fast as possible. You know, it's not even an option. You want to lose it tomorrow. So, of course, you're not going to eat this extra food today. So, I'm going to do that. And uh, I hope that I can lose it in one month because at the beginning of next month, month early April, I'll have a keynote speech in, in USC. And I really don't want to explain to the crowd why I have this huge beard. You know, they'll probably laugh at me. But, so that's what I'm trying to do. And, oh, and please remember to remind me, whenever you see that I have a beard growing out, just make fun of me. Make me feel really, really bad and embarrassed. Like, make me feel like a loser. And then I'm for sure going to have that motivation to, to lose that weight <laughs> if I'm feeling that bad about everyone making fun of me, right? So do that. And I'm probably going to upload a new video every week to let you guys see how, how's my beard growing pr progress and, you know, if I've lost weight and when I lose all my weight and shave my beard, I'll, I'll you know, have another video too so you can see the difference. I probably look like a baby or whatnot, right? So we'll see how that goes. And it's, the whole process is pretty FD, right? Fun and productive um, is, is what we call future delivery FD um, because losing weight is obviously productive and it gets you to become more productive, whereas... You know, putting yourself on the spot, your reputation in front of the world is, is fun. It's exciting, actually. It's like if you do something mundane, it's boring. But if you do if you do it through a reality show, the whole world's watching you, it's actually more exciting and interesting, and you have more motivation to do it, right? So I will keep you guys posted on how well I do, what's going to happen, and you have been FDTized. See you guys later.